just first off, thoughts on thoughts on the camp this week? Ну, лагерь прошел хорошо, то, что я как Алгалан говорил уже, что третий мой был сбор, и я очень доволен, как все закончилось, что я прибавил, вырос как игрок в плане уверенности, стало больше, в принципе, готов на все, буду сейчас готовиться к основному лагерю, доказываю себя там. Well, basically, uh, I'm very happy about the way the camp uh, went on. Uh, basically, uh, everything worked out exactly the way I was hoping for. But uh, at this point, uh, the main camp is coming in September, and that's where I intend to prove myself. Obviously, you want to make team eventually, but do you have your eyes set on, on Hershey, and, and how good do you think that season's going to be in Hershey? Well, of course, you're not going to be able to play with them, but you're going to be able to play Well, so the, the, that's where I'm going to have to prove myself, and uh, um, I'm just going to try to do my best. Uh, I have plenty of room to grow as a hockey player, and if I do end up in Hershey, well, uh, I will just uh, try to prove uh, them that they were wrong, and send me back there and try to work my way back here. What were the benefits of playing the second half of the year in Hershey last year? То, что, конечно, играл я в металлурге, да, в КХЛ, то, что тяжело было, мы там всего держали 5 побед или 7 побед в чемпионате, но это очень мало, и тяжело было, можно сказать, постоянно проигрывали, тяжело. И приехал Ферши, победы пошли, и настроение все равно хорошее, в этом плане, конечно, легче, и настроение совсем другое. И ты растешь, когда выигрываешь, когда тяжело, когда ты постоянно внизу, и, можно сказать, уже обреченный, выходишь на игры, вроде стараешься сделать, а все-таки не очень сильно помогло. Well, I played for uh, Novo Kuznetsk uh, for five months uh, before I went uh, to Hershey. Uh, I was on a really bad team. And uh, it, you know, we only won like five or seven games the whole year. And it was getting kind of uh, almost depressing that you, you, know, you go on the ice, you try your best, but nothing good happens. And, uh, we're kind of stuck in the rut. When I uh, went to Hershey uh, uh, toward the end of the season, the atmosphere was completely different. Uh, you pretty much, when you go you know, prepare for the game, uh, you feel very excited about it. The atmosphere is very positive, and you uh, just a winning atmosphere. And that's how uh, I felt about it. And also, I learned a lot about uh, playing in North America from playing in Hershey. I'm interested in his thoughts in uh, Galliot's play this week, or in general. Uh, well, I think he had a very good week here, he had a very good camp, and uh, he seemed to be he's grown a lot uh, since last year, and uh, he gained a lot uh, as a hockey player, and uh, he will, uh, he actually looked this week, he looked like uh, one of the best, if not the best forward on the ice, and I'm sure that uh, he's going to have his chance here to prove himself as well. Final thing for me, I'm, ju I'm just curious, on the ice, everyone's, most people are speaking English, how much of a, a challenge that, that has been, or, or the adjustment to, to the environment? Есть какие-то слова, которые я не знаю, в принципе, я уже хоккейный термин немного понимаю, разбираюсь, но что-то запомнил, но так что, в принципе, нормально сейчас. Well, uh, uh, it's important that uh, hockey is uh, somewhat universal language. Uh, yes, uh, well, maybe some problems with English, but uh, I know how to play hockey, and uh, speaking about hockey is much easier, and uh, 
it, it, it's all right. I'm getting used to it, and I'm making uh, improvements, and uh, that's how it's going to be. Last Good. question, guys. You are? Pardon me? You, you, you 